Welcome back to Return of the Obra Dinn. At the end of the last episode, we just started on the final chapter that we can do before, I guess, what's considered the end of the game, which is murder. Was that chapter two? I don't remember. Let's check. Mm, ah, it's chapter three is murder. Yes, and there's bargain, which is only revealed... Bargain is only revealed after we turn in the book. And what about escape? Have we seen that? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So we saw escape, and we saw the end at the very beginning, ironically, of the game. So before the end of the game, the last chapter is murder. So this is one of the Formosan guards. Formosan royalty guards. Can I not highlight you? I thought I could. Huh. Anyway, just take my word for it. <laughs> Pak Sheng Lao, you have been found guilty by self-confession of the murder of Nunzio Pasqua. Quiet. As captain of this ship, and by the authority of the East India Company, and thus the Crown of England, I sentence you to death by firing line. <laughs> Mr. Wolf, when you are ready. Right, sir. Ready, men. Aim. Fire! There was a lot of information in that dialogue. Is this... Yes. This is the moment that's depicted in that picture, or... Is it a picture or a painting? They hadn't invented cameras at this point, so... Painting? Drawing? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Look at that! Oh, that's so cool! That's the artist. H.S., was it? E.S. Edward Spratt, the artist, is the one who drew this. Yeah, this person has their hand on Miss Miss whatever their name was. Let's let's check. Boon Lon? Yep. It says Eat Bang. They're being held back from this, which uh, I mean, I don't know what to make of this self-confession. They say they didn't do it. Someone said that's too late. I don't know what the hell happened yet. It'll probably become clear. I thought perhaps, perhaps uh, this must be Hok Seng Lao. Yeah, you have been found guilty by self-confession. Well, we know their name. Um, I thought they might be on that rope because they were being used as, I don't know, bait or something. It never crossed my mind that I would actually encounter the memory that I see in that picture that was drawn. Hok Seng Lao. Hook Sing Lao. How do I mark how they were killed? They were shot, yes, but by who? Can I say shot by everyone? Oh, and they were accused of killing Nunzio Pasqua, which is a passenger from Italy. I have no idea what they're all about. Hoxang Lao. That means, just by process of elimination, we can identify the other guard. They're listed as a three-triangle difficulty? It's not difficult anymore. They must be the other Formosan royalty. <laughs> Chiao Ton. Huh. 
Um, is executed an option? Shot. Expired. Eaten. No. So shot. By gun. By... By... I guess I should say by the captain, because they're the one who gave the order, right? Hold on a second. Who was the acting captain at this captain at this time? Was it still Witterall? Are you giving the order? Your hands out in a kind of suggestive way. I don't know who you are, but you're certainly not the captain. It must be you, right? The fourth mate. Uh, let me look at the dialogue again. No, he has done nothing wrong. Miss Lehman is too late. Somebody said quiet. And then, as captain of the ship and by the authority of the East India Company and thus the Crown of England, I sentence you to death by firing line. Mr. Wolf, when you are ready. Right, sir. Ready, men. Aim. Fire. Okay, so Mr. Wolf. Mr. Wolf is this person. Mr. Wolf. Christian Wolf Gunner. I'm wondering if perhaps... Um, one of the other jobs is listed as Gunner's Mate. I wonder if the Gunner's Mate would be, like, right next to him? Nobody seems to be... super close to him. Are they super close to him in the picture? You're kinda close. You c you might be Gunner's Mate, actually. They're this person, aren't they? They are pretty close. I think that's the Gunner's Mate. Olus Wieter. Right, all the captains are here. So it is Robert Witterell. Okay, Robert Witterell killed him, I think, ultimately. Anything more in the dialogue? Getting a lot of information out of this one. The Formosan Royalty Guard's name. Got the, the Gunner's name, and then kind of by process of elimination and association, we got the Gunner's mate. Oh, they also mentioned the murder of Nunzio Pasqua, but I have no idea who that is. Other than they're a fellow passenger from Italy, was it? And it must have happened quite early on. Because this is only chapter three. But yeah, I don't think I can do anything with Nunzio just yet. Wait a minute. My hand is shaking, and as soon as I press this, I need, I'm going to need to go to the other body. Oh, this is the other body, isn't it? This is probably Nunzio, I would imagine. Okay, let's look around. Carpenter's mate, Marcus Gibbs. No idea. The bosun. Oh. <laughs> I just realized how funny it is that in the picture they're in the same place as they are in the scene because the drawing was made of the scene. Yeah, makes sense. Oh, you're the one who was electrocuted.
So all the ones doing the shooting. Seamen. Seamen. So they're all seamen. Do I know who they all are? I don't know who you are. Yet. It's all the captains. Are you like whispering? It looks like this person's like whispering to this person. Who are you? You one of the mates? Second mate, Edward Nichols. Ah, oh, yeah, Edward Nichols and this person were both on the boats later on in the calling chapter. So I think they're probably hatching a plan, talking to Nichols. Third mate, Martin Parrot. Third mate, Steward, right next to him. Makes sense. Hey! Is that the same chicken we saw some other time? Somehow free? Maybe it's like the crew chicken just hangs around and it's just like a friend. I'm trying to see if there's any identifying things behind them. Like, perhaps they have their names written on the back of their shirts in bold letters. <laughs> well, I don't know. It could be. Oh! Monkey! Monkey riding a goat. Hmm. Oh, this is the cook and the butcher. You're the cook. You're the butcher. Yes. Oh, this symbol here. That's because I bookmarked them? Yeah, I bookmarked them a while ago. I can unbookmark them. Right, I think that's it. Oh, actually, wait. Um, actually, let's look at all these people. We know these two. Who's trying to, like, stop them, keep them apart? Oh, the other Formosan royalty guard. That's one of the other, I think, one of the Chinese seamen. You're once again that weirdly important dude... Don't know who you are. Carpenter. They don't want to listen. Fair enough. Davy James. Is that like a joke? Davy James? Davy Jones? John Davies. Okay. You still waiting for me down there, buddy? You are. Thanks. I feel like one time I'm going to go back there and they're going to be gone. Hello. Who is there? Who is that? Is someone hurt? Eh? Senor Nichols, is that you? What are you doing down here? Oh, hello, yes. All fine here. Just, uh, sorting some things. Watch your step. Here, let me help you. So they were murdered, but... They were murdered by Edward Nichols. Self-confessed, they said. This Formosan royalty guard, sorry, I forgot their name. Can I not? That's weird. I, I can't like get their name if I mouse over them, unlike the other people. 
I can only get it from up here. Uh, you? Yes. Hoxing. Hoxing Lao. The captain said that Hoxing Lao had confessed to the murder. Assuming that's even true at all, which it might not be, why would they confess to this murder? To try to save Nichols? Why? Oh. Oh. In that picture, they're playing a violin. So they're probably a passenger, I would imagine. Like, I would imagine seamen probably can't play violins, generally. It's not possible, but... Well, we know how they were killed. They were stabbed. Knifed. Knifed. By Edward Nichols. And apparently they only show up in this memory. Hmm. And they're listed as just one triangle, like they should be super easy. Was their name? Oh. Wait. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Of course we have their name. We know exactly what their name is. I had a major brain fart. I remembered that we had their name, but I wasn't making the connection between having the name and being able to assign it to a person. But now that we have the actual person here, we can assign it, of course. <laughs> Nunzio Pasqua. Yes, a passenger from Italy. Ooh. Yes? Yes? Oh, hell yeah. Been waiting for that forever. Nunzio Pasqua. Knifed by Edward Nichols. Boon Lon Lim, clawed by a terrible beast. Eat Bang Sia, burned to death. Okay, so it's right to say that they were burned. Heck yeah, I'm like a fourth done with the game. Um... Look at the dialogue again. Oh yeah, and then we have this person over here. This... Oh, is that the one that confessed to the murder? Yes! Huck Seng Lao. So they weren't killed here. They were hit and knocked out. With a club. But they weren't killed. They were guarding... The chest that's in here. And inside of there is a shell that's shining. So... I had some question about whether there was a shell that came from inside of this box. As we saw in The Calling. All the boats out in the water being attacked by the mermaids. Because... It didn't, it didn't seem like a shell came out of the box in that scene. Yet one of the mermaids had a shell, so I thought... I don't know, maybe just the shell had nothing to do with the box. But I think there's just more than one shell. The mermaid had a shell. Although perhaps that is the same shell as this one. I don't know. This was... So the shell was on board. Did they... Did the Formosan royalty bring the box on board since day one? I'm not sure how to answer that question, really. 
Yeah, I don't know. But it was here in murder. Which isn't very far on. This is when they're near the Canary Islands. Oh yeah, loose, loose cargo. That happened right at port. Let's look at the dialogue. The one who died. So, Nunzio. Hello, who's there? Who's that? Is someone hurt? Eh? Senor Nichols, is that you? What are you doing down here? Yeah, it's all fine here. Just uh, sorting some things. Watch your step. Let me help you. You're dead. Right, so... Basically, Nunzio just stumbled into the wrong place at the wrong time and witnessed... the crime... that Nichols was committing, so they decided to kill a witness. Now what? Okay, just discovered something. Um, but first thing I did was look through the book, and I did find one thing. The Doom. Although we did experience some of the, some of the events in the Doom, we have not finished it. Notice it doesn't have the, like, checkmark things, whatever the heck those mean exactly down here. Also, part one, nothing. Part two, on the bow, bow, nothing. Then part three, we have something. Crushed by a terrible beast. Yeah, a whole bunch of things happened in the Doom. But we haven't discovered the first couple parts. Then I was just wandering around the ship, and on the gun deck I noticed this blood leading into this room. There's a knife. I don't know if this... It probably didn't just appear, I would imagine. It's probably been there and I just missed it before. And inside is a body that I don't think we've been into before. I tried my best. I... Oh, we have seen this. You tell it yourself. Never mind then. Ah, oh, this is the new thing, I think. At the back... Or is this... Is this the front of the gun deck? Yeah, this is the front. So, the front of the gun deck. There's one of those weird looking doors that's open now. Looking all fuzzy. And I don't think we've ever been here. And there's a body. 